Hey, aloha, this is Quetzalcoatl. In the spiritual community, there seems to be a conundrum around money. When it comes to money, there's a belief that people who are spiritual shouldn't be receiving money. And then when it comes to spirituality, there should be no money involved. There's even a belief that everything in nature is free. Well, that couldn't be further from the truth. Nothing in nature is free. Nothing in this reality is free. Even if you can't see it, even if somebody else is doing it for you, there's always an exchange taking place. Take, for instance, the fruit tree. Okay, you might be able to take fruit from a tree, but how did you get to that fruit tree? If you didn't use a car, if you didn't use a plane, if you didn't use a bus, if you didn't use any form of modern transportation, you will have to use your own body's energy to hike and walk and search and find that elusive fruit. Even once you got to the fruit, you would have to, if it wasn't at arm's reach, climb that tree to get that fruit that you were looking for. Even when you got it, you might have to process it. If it's an orange, you might have to peel it. If it's a coconut, you have to break it open and use your own energy. Even digesting is gonna take your energy. Nothing about that process is free. It's always an exchange of energy. It will always be an exchange of energy because this is the way that life balances itself out. You can't receive without giving back. By default, that is the exchange system of the universe. Currency is just a representation for energy that we put in. So we work uh, 40 hours a week and we get a paycheck. That paycheck is just a representation of the work we put in. Now we've put it into currency form. With that currency, we can buy other things that take energy, that take labor to make. It's just an exchange system. Inherently within itself, there's nothing evil about that. Now people will take anything and make it selfish, make it greedy, make it for a purpose that's out of alignment with the natural flow of life. Sure, that can be said about everything, but the inherent nature of currency and money is not evil. It is the mind of the person that's abusing it that is so. So understand that that nothing is free there's always going to be an exchange even if you can't easily see it but under the surface you will see if you can trace that back far enough you'll see that there was an exchange that took place somebody's energy is being used to process the food to grow the food to harvest the food that you get even in nature even these trees out here there has already been energy put to grow these certain varieties of trees and in the way that you see them today so it's been all a process it's all been an exchange it's never been free and it never will be. You shouldn't even want things to be free because you shouldn't want to be able to receive without giving. This is the essential exchange in life that makes life beautiful and balances things out. So that's the message for today. Nothing is free. All is an exchange. Look forward to exchanging. Look forward to giving for what you receive. It is only fair. It is only just. All right. Till next time. Stay balanced. Peace.